What's up? Oh, it's just me. What's up, man? What's up, guys? Game seven? What? What? Astros one zip. The slowest home run trot I've seen. Come on, guys. What it do? Dante, Dante. I don't know, I'm not sure about Flawless. Isaac, good. Night Lord. Troy, I'm always talking to myself, man. Yeah, I'm either talking to me or, or Moose. I gotta listen to the game while I drive. I hear you, man. My prediction, it's gonna be a heartbreak. A lot of broken hearts in DC tonight. I think Houston's. Uh, I think Houston's taking it down. What's up, Chad? We'll see. <laughs> Yours included. <laughs> oh man, my heart break from my beat. My heart might break from being so happy. Houston back in July. That's, that's looking good. Looking like a genius. So, we got some Game 7 chat. We have... Uh, it's not yet because I'm completely happy. We have uh, a couple breaks planned. There's a, a main... Big boy break. I think seven teams left. What's in front of us. And then the nighttime late night budget break actually is pretty strong too. There's eight hits in it. That's behind. And what we're going to do is we're going to random off the, uh, the hits in the Elite Extra. There could be Alonzo, Soto, Eloy, all kind of stuff. And if you see that little stack of stuff there, that is... Coming along, I should probably have the PSA lot listed tomorrow. I'm hoping, I'm hoping to have it listed tomorrow. But we do have the mini vintage to break. We'll probably break that first. Uh, mini vintage 10.0. I actually swapped out one of the, uh, the team sets for another Hank Aaron. So that'll be fun to watch. That's mini 10.0. Win, Brian, what it do, what it do. So, I'm surprised, like, Scherzer pitched. It was, it was kind of crazy turn of events. Do you think they were trying to, like, psych them out or something? I don't know. But it's a long, it's a long game. What's up, Jamie? Andy. What's up, Matt? So I'll know probably tomorrow. It's going to be roughly around $40. I'll have the exact figure tomorrow. JDLS, what's up? What's up? More errands are always welcome. <laughs> so the mini break, let's see here. Who do I have in the mini break? That's the wrong screen. So 
So yeah, I'm hoping to have that live. There's going to be like 45 to 47 spots or something like that. So there'll be uh, plenty of time. I don't imagine it's going to sell right out. But, uh, you know, the 1968 set we did, that thing sold out in like three days. Uh, I think this is probably more fun than that. What up, Wax? Hype it up to 125 tonight. Uh, it's going to be tough. We might be competing with the World Series tonight, Mike. Could be tough for 125. Mike, the hype, dude, the hype it, do. There we go. Where's my mini at? Where's my mini at? All right, cool. I got Doug... C, Ricky C, Tim A, Tim A, Jamie E, Steve E, Steve, Steve, Jamie E one, Steve A twice, Travis W, Eric K twice, Chad T once, Jeff P once, Robert C twice in the mini 10.0. So... Oh, uh, yeah, cardboard, 100% I will. Yeah, and I imagine, um, I, don't, I don't know, I imagine at this price point it might take two weeks. I just, I wanted to put, I guess I can show you a little bit what's in here, right? You guys want a sneak peek? A little bit? I mean, so it's not going to be, it's not going to be a mystery. These things are going to be just like, um, just like the uh, the hits we've been doing, like the all the point O's, where it, the, the, the checklist is going to say what's in it. So it's, it'll be, uh, the mystery is going to be like which one you get, <laughs> depending on how the spots line up. So, but I mean, we can show a little bit what's in here now, I guess, right? That's probably like the, the biggie. Yeah, it's rookie. Clemente second year, and then even the non the non home run cards I I picked it. There's no Cedric Mullins, like seventy eight tops Munson, Ripken rookie, Wade Boggs rookie in an eight. Here's a seventy five Nolan Ryan highlights in a seven, sixty eight Carew uh, game card. So even it's it's all good stuff. Blood X, what it do? Hey, Blood X. Hey, man. Um, I got your thing already, but uh, e I got your email, the address. But if you can't email me back, the what name to put on it? I've had so much mail returned to me just trying to use like a YouTube name. So please, uh, if you can, just email me and uh, we'll do that. Ripken, not a Ripken rookie. There's a there's a Mint Chipper Jones rookie. Uh, this card's sweet. Mint, these are 78s and 9s are really hard. So 78, 9 Schmitz. Lou Brock. So there's a lot of, uh, you want the Ryan rookie? Someone's going to get the Ryan rookie on the cheap. But my idea was for these things to make it kind of like the point O's, where if you don't get the, the super duper monster, you at least get something you like and make you want to do it again you know so i'll be trying to do these more often they're not going to replace like the point o's it's just going to be something else we do so there's a sandberg rookie in an eight here's a carlton fisk rookie what else in here 79 79 johnny bench wade bonds rookie another wade bonds rookie uh so no the psa is on uh, PSA is not on the website yet. I'm probably gonna have this on tomorrow. I'll be going live tomorrow, and then I'll blast, I'll blast it out um, tomorrow for sure. And plus, I'll see you guys live. There's 47 spots. So I don't think it's not gonna fill up like in one email. So yeah, there's no Cedric Mullins, Dale Murphy rookie. 77 Carew, it's a pretty card. So, hopefully, 73 Rose. Look at that, 60 Mickey Mantle. The Mickey Mantle Boyer card. This card's actually in the mini tonight. 
This card's in the mini tonight. Not graded, but that's a cool card. 1960 Mantha Boyer. These things are neat. I got one of these right now on PSA. So this is a Topps decal. These came in 1969. They came in the packs. So most so, you can imagine, it's like a little sheet of paper. It's like a rub-off. Most of these have been, like, destroyed. So I have a Reggie Jackson, like, quote-unquote, rookie card because it's from 69. I have one of those at PSA right now. But this is a Gibson. So this is a 69 decal. There's a 69 Pete Rose. There's a couple of heaters. <laughs> yeah, that was my goal. My goal is to have like five like high dollar cards and then everything else. I mean, like I'm a huge Oriole fan. So if I get this, I mean, I'm happy. <laughs> so anyway, and that's most of them. I think there's like, I got to pick out like seven more from the archive. What up, Sean? Yeah, man. Little preview. Little preview. Polly. Um, it's going to go live tomorrow. We're going to do, um, we're about to hit up a, a mini 10.0. We got two breaks tonight. So I was just kind of going over some of the cards that are in it. And if you missed out, I can show you like the more of the, the heaters, the chase cards. Chase cards for sure will be the, the second year Clemente in 1956. Second year Clemente. Yastrzemski rookie will be a chase card. This is the ultimate chase card. It's good centering on that too. Just that one corner could have been a little bit higher, but real pretty card, real pretty centered. Ryan rookie, mantle. So that'll be a lot of fun. I know breaking. Yeah, I thought about that, man. I was like, is anybody gonna come hang out? It's game seven. But I figure. I figure most of us use our phones for YouTube, right? It's kind of like you kind of have the TV rolling too. TV and the, uh, what you call it? One day I'll own one. Can never have too many Ryan rookies. When I was looking at some of the prices, um, like I did a little throwback, uh, not throw punch. Time Machine Tuesday, I call mine. Yesterday, even like the 86 Nolan Ryan in it was like really is like trending up. Everything's trending up. So we'll talk about that more for sure. Mike the hype dude. I love it. Alright, so let's get started on this, guys. Let me Called our names again. I need to find my Sharpie. And then uh, there's two breaks. So there's two breaks tonight. Um, how many do you have? I wish I was so many Nolan Ryan rookies. Doug C, Ricky C, Tim A twice, Jamie E, Steve A twice, uh, Travis W, Eric two times, Chad T, Jeff P, Robert C twice. Doug C once, okay. Yeah, gray and a five is sweet. The one in the breaks a three. A three centered. He was thinking you, you were like, had five of them just line, line them up at the house. All right. Also, guys, so when this is done, if we're if we're full, we'll get in the main break. Hopefully, we that's in front of me. Hopefully, we see some something cool. Uh, there's one spot left. <laughs> All right, so there's one spot left in this. So we'll probably be getting in on that when this is done. There's 14 spots left for the late night break. Glenn is here. All 
Yeah, we're going to do the mini first. Um, the mini is always like 15 spots, so it shouldn't take, it won't take that long. And then there's, uh, we'll wait for that last spot to fill up. All the bums under one roof. No, not all the bums. Just the best bums. No audio for Joe iPhone. Sorry about that, Joe. Uh, I guess for now I'll turn on that focus. Five can go off. There we go. <laughs> Your iPhone might need to be serviced. <laughs> uh, truth in the house. Truth's ready for the break tonight. Also, it looks like I have one spot left in this issue with, I guess, the inventory on the site. And I put in an extra Mickey, uh, Mickey Mouse. I put in an extra Hank Aaron, and I took out one of the team lots. So if anybody wants to get in this break we're doing right now, you just send me directly 1099, and then I'll put you in. Andy says he wants it. Okay, got you. So Andy has it. Done and done. This is Mini 10.0. Mini 10.0. Um, I'll have the uh, the PSA. Let me call the names again right now. Hang on. Uh, da, 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 da. Hang on. We call the names I have right now. Um, I'll know tomorrow. JT. It's gonna be around forty dollars. Nice. Okay. Cool. So main is sold out. Uh, Doug C, Ricky C, Tim A twice, Jamie E, Steve A, Travis W, Eric K, Chad, Eric K twice, Chad T once, Jeff P once, Robert C twice, and then I had Andy with the first. I'll take it in the chat because that was not on the site. Um, I need BIDG spending cash for the PSA break. <laughs> All right, Andy F is in the last mini spot, so that's 15. Um, Todd, maybe you might be in the next uh, main. I uh, we just started filling the other one, and then there's also. If anybody missed out on this one, there is a mini 11.0. I believe we're on 11.0 already. Let me take a look. 11.0 that's on the site. Yeah, 12.0 is on the site with a, a very clean Mickey Mantle on the second year. <coughs> second year Nolan Ryan is in 12.0.
Yeah, 11.0 is on the site. All there. Mantle checklist, a Mantle Boyer card. Second year Jordan, that's a PSA 8 as that quote unquote big ticket. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, Soto stock has definitely gone up, huh? Soto stock. It's almost like you wish baseball season like didn't end. Like at this time at this point where it's like if you're like a big Soto collector and all of a sudden, you know. Alright, season's over. But it's November in like two days, right guys? So it's gonna be it's coming. Pitchers and catchers. Four and a half months. All right, let's check out Roll the Dice. Let's get rolling on some content, guys. So we are three. Three times. Three times. I'm not a bum. So bum's like a term of endearment by, uh, I guess iPhone turned it into endearment. I don't know. Or it could be iPhone's way of making fun of us without us knowing. But you wouldn't do that. All right, so we have 15 players. Give me one second. All right, so for our spots, one, two, and three. There we go. Jamie with spot one, Tim A with the last spot. Let me put those in the room for us. And we'll start. So again, this is mini 10.0. If you guys missed out, mini 11.0 is on the site. And so is the main 12.0, which has a second year Ryan and a Mickey Mantle. And the much anticipated PSA will drop tomorrow. There we go. Okay. Let me get back in the chat real quick. There we go. I'm the Warren Buffett of his stock. <laughs> yep. I mean, I've I have a feeling if. He starts out, let's say the Nationals don't win the night, even if they do win the night, whatever. If he comes out, if Soto comes out like and has like a hot spring, hot first month of baseball, I could see his stuff being more than Acuna for sure. All right, Jamie E, pack one. Let's do this, guys. Walk up in the house. Nice. So, yeah, I don't know. Uh, I'll be live tomorrow, and then I'd imagine it's, you know, it's not going to sell it one night. So, I'm, I'm sure everyone who wants a spot will be able to get some spots in. All right, Jamie scores a. 
1972, Hank Aaron, right off the start. There's two of these in here. This one's the better graded one. Very nice. No birthday cards in this one, no. <laughs> All right, that's a sweet one for Jamie in spot one. Now it's going to Eric in spot two. Yeah, I definitely got a couple uh, wanders up my sleeve too, Truth. He's going to be a little bit longer. But I've seen his prices come down a little bit the past month. I think the playoffs, I don't think people forgot about him, but there's different, different things taking the hype. Different products have been coming out that we've been chasing. <clears throat> Bowman was released so Bowman gets released so early before like some of the flagship top products. So I feel like Wander had more, got more like just hype then. All right, forks in two, forks in two. I'm not sure how many times you've hit this one already, but Ozzy rookie can never go wrong. That was a nice touch. Yeah, I'm trying to. I'm. I'm hope soon I get fancy. At least this is uh, quick. But I'm hoping to get fancy with some of the. Uh, I want to try it for the PSA. I just gotta see if I can get it here in time. Is the the silver packs? You know, the silver packs that I heat up. Three, 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 three. Travis W. So the biggest one in here is probably gonna be the 65, Aaron. Sixty-five and all right, Travis. Card sweet. Yastrzemski, Killebrew, Robinson. One, a two, a three Hall of Famers. My favorite pitcher is a big Frank too. He just looks happy there. That's for Travis. Um, good question. Walk off. Um, um, probably as the channel grows a little bit, I could see us doing another one. Uh, the football thing. Robert C and four. Um, it won't be like a, and then it will be like kind of like a normal thing. It just, it took a little bit longer for that one to, uh, to fill. All right. Happy birthday on. Sunday, send all sodas to Woodbridge. <laughs> uh, all right, Robert C. Nice. Set 1978, rookie catchers, Dale Murphy and Lance Parrish. And this is pretty good, pretty good condition. I got the, I got the, Autofocus on now, but I'll take it off when we get into the break so there's no more focusing issues. Five. Chad T. Yeah, no, for sure. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, people that... Um, did the football. I mean, it's pretty good, pretty good feedback. Chad T. Takes on the other Aaron. There's still one more. The big boy's still in here, the 65, but there you go, Chad. 1972 Hank Aaron. Clean. 357 with the Super Chat. JW is stocking up on Jeter rookie cards. I heard he's a legend. Stocking up when he can, I think. Tim A. Tim A and 6. What's our time? Where are we at? 30 minute mark. Huh. 
All right, cool. He has 50 so far. I think I think out of the 50, I think five are like PSA 10 gold for 93 tops. Isn't that nuts? Look at the gold silly. 50, where are they? <laughs> Tim A, the Whitey Ford, 66. Throwing his ever growing vintage collection. Nice 10. Jeff P. Apparently, I cleaned up a good label. <laughs> Man. You thought you sent this to show to get graded. iPhone graded, monkey grade. Monkey, he could grade them in like bananas. Like, eight, it's like an eight point banana. All right. Jeff P gets a Nelly Fox 64. Colts. I love the vintage stuff with the old names that were um, top later. The old names that are no longer a team. I'll swap that for a new top letter. I'll have a talk of quality control. There we go. Clean top loader. That was Jeff P in seven. Now we're in eight, going back to Eric. Man, I hope, uh, I kind of hoping for Montreal to get their Expos back, like the Expos, and like have them retain the records and all that stuff. I see a 69 card poking out, I think. Yep. Gibson Fergie. 69 pitching leaders. Throwing a forks in the chat. Send the Rays to Montreal. Yeah, Montreal jerseys are definitely clean. Nine is Ricky. Ricky C. Yep. Ricky gets the two pack seventy eight Nolan Ryan record breaker and the seventy eight Reggie Jackson record breaker. These are both nice. Florida is not a baseball state. <laughs> Florida is definitely like an amateur baseball state. An amateur in from peewee to through college because they can play it year round. A lot of good ball players come from Florida. You got SEC country down there, it's a very competitive. Ten is Doug C. Doug C. cannot get the Aussie rookie. It's been pulled. Was that fourth inning? Fourth inning. 
What's up, man? Perfect timing. Jeez. It's a clean card in here. One of the best hits, the Roger Maris. 64. Little miscut, as you can see, the start of the team name below. I can't tell what team name that would have been. But sharp otherwise. That is 10 for Doug C. Patreon Pirate in the chat. Now we're on 11. For Robert C. So we're still hunting for the 65 Hank Aaron. Um, and there's some multi-pack left. Says, look, that's true. <laughs> you could if you wanted to shave that off. Robert C. Koufax Gibson Drysdale. Koufax Gibson Drysdale. Nice. That was Robert C. in 11. Whoa, nice. Very good day for this guy right here. Just found out. Number three. Awesome, man. Andy. Coming in with the spot he took. The last possible moment. No twins, I hope not. <laughs> uh, ERA leaders, Gibson. And Bob Veal was definitely no slouch. I've been wondering if Bob Veal was going to get in one day himself. Thirty-six year old Granky on fire. Oh, yeah, well, 36-year-old Verlander couldn't get it done yesterday. Put that in a better top loader. Cleaner top loader. I like that card, Andy. 65 Aaron could be last. That'd be crazy. It happened in the mantle the other day. 13 Steve A. Well, it's down to, it's down to two guys that have definitely slugged it out before. Steve Hay and Tim A. <laughs> They've been known to slug it out 13, 14, and 15. Okay. 
I was cut back to two mails a day. Two lingered cards. Uh, yeah, Verlander's record, uh, I guess postseason period, even the Tigers, right? Remember the Orioles in the, in the Divisional Series gave him a little spanking in, I guess, 2014. That was great. Steve A. with 78. 78 hot pack. Reggie Jackson. Stargell. Bisque and Barack. Yeah, the Orioles beat three Cy Young winners in those uh, in that three game series: Scherzer, Verlander, and I forget the other one now. Fourteen. Steve A. Again. Yeah, this one looks like it's a multi-lot. 15 looks like it's going to be the 65. 81s for Steve A. Clean, clean, clean cards. Brett and Schmidt and Yount. Bench, Morgan, and Steady Reggie. Fifteen ten A. Sixty five Hammer and Hank. Tim A. Right back. Tim May. <laughs> All right, cool. All right, guys. Thanks everyone that got into that. Thanks for watching. Those little minis are fun little quick hitters. If you missed out on that, if you're interested, on the website, there is a 12.0 running. Uh, is Rath in here? Rath's probably watching the World Series. I have a piece of mail I wanted to open from him. But let me get the rest of the names for... The big boy break. What up, Grant? George Springer going yard twice, MVP. All right, let's pull the list up. All right, we left off there. Be a second, guys. The Strohs won't win. Good, Grant. 
excited for game seven. Eric K three times. Like G. And Sean D. Let's check it out. All right, so tonight's main break right in front of us. Going to hopefully see some boomers in tribute, but don't count out Prism for hitting some kind of weird autograph in there. There's at least one auto. And then we have the Chronicles on top. There is a late night break uh, for $8.99 a team with eight hits. And that there's 14 teams left in that one if you didn't get in this break. In this break, I have All Sport Twice, 618, Alex B, Robert C, Andy F three times, Chad T, Glenn twice, Truth once, Travis W, Terry B, JD twice, Andy B twice, Amu twice, Sam C once, Elliot W once, Matt G once, Charles H once, Eric three times, Mike G two times, and Sean D. There's the link for the late night. And let's get going here. Yeah, there's been a... The Prism basketball just came out. Ah, okay, cool. Gotcha. Let me take those out right now so they don't get gobbled up. There we go. 12 spots left. All right, let's do this real quick. Three times. One, two, three. Teams. One, two, three. All right. Let's you guys look at that for a second. And I'll put that in the chat.
All right, hopefully that's lining up good for everybody. Chat's back on. There we go. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, Matt, they are. Yeah, uh, uh, Alonzo's in Tribute. Yep. Tribute's nice because they got a lot of uh, retired Hall of Famers in there and a mix of current, current studs. <laughs> Reels. Man, I've seen some really cool Cal Ripkins come out of there. To get some kind of crazy Ripken autograph, yours, yours truly might make an offer on it right here, right now. Um, yeah, if you guys, uh, it's game seven. BITG's in a good mood. If you guys want to trade, I know this is a premium product, so anytime we do something premium, I try to let you guys trade. Um, we're going to start from smaller... In that in that order, we'll start with the Chronicles first. There's bad, then there's Orioles. <laughs> uh, I'll take I'll take a tribute, silly patch of Cal Ripken or autograph over a lot of cards in there. Did uh, Glenn's trying to acquire his Mariners, trying to get that Griffey. Love to pull Griffey in there. What's up, T-Dog? T-Dog. Uh, you talking about the, the, the late night break, Rob? This is uh, the main one. This is the, uh, the Tribute Prism. And uh, this the the regular chronicles. Let me see here real quick. Did you get in the late night one also? Let me just see if I can find your name real quick. Uh, yeah, you did. Yeah, man, you're good. Yep, you're in the you're in the late night break three times in that bad boy. I oh, know you're good. No, yeah, I don't trust my site a hundred percent. So. Please, yeah, anytime, be like, hey, just check my spots, check my spots. Oh, Doyle rules. <laughs> That's true, yeah, every, yeah. Uh, I missed it. Did you guys, did you, did, there we go, thank you, Glenn. Ma my thanks for the highlight, and that works good on my screen. Mariners for Cubs, okay. Let's see if I can do this. Obviously, uh. Thirty names. Where are the Mariners? Right up top. Gotcha. So Mariners are gonna be Glenn. Okay, and then we said Cubbies. Ah, right there. How about that? That's easy. All right. Does that look right?
Yellow parallel Vladdy from update. Joe's hyping it up. Joe hyped something up? Never. All right, from this focus off so we can see the cards. All right. All right, cool. All right, so we'll start from top to bottom. We'll start with a little, the baby product here. We have gotten some good uh, hits from here, though. Top letters ready. Okay, cool. All right, guys, let's see some fire. All in all, we're going to see, uh, I guess, at least, at least 15 hits tonight, all in all. So I'm hoping there's some bangers out of that. Save the unparalleled, sure. Here we go. Main break. Game seven. If somebody hits a banger, they'll always remember. They'll tell stories about it. It was game seven of the World Series. I got into a break. Eloy rookie. There's a trout. And Ichiro. Just one out of the 15. Sweet Vlad playoff for Toronto. Bowers and an Otani. Rowdy tell us. Another Otani. Nice Mike Trout certified. And I feel like there could be a relic in here. This could be hit 16, if that's what it is. Or it could be one of those uh, Spectras or something. Nope, it's a relic. Woo! 16 hits, guys. 16 hits tonight. Be cool. Be cool. Nice. That's a good one. That's a nice one. Walker Bueller. Cool. Dodgers. Chad T. Takes a little nice little bonus hit out of Chronicles. Uh, no, Chronicles only break is uh, after. This is uh, like the main break with the Tribute and the Prism. The Chronicles with the uh, the Elite Extra is coming up uh, ap maybe right after this one, actually. All right, that's cool, Chad. A little bonus. Cardi key, boom. Crusade. Oh, that's pretty. Two got Toronto. Already got a couple of Vlads. Blue Jays. This sucker's numbered. Night Lord. Night Lord. Is that 149? Nice. Brandon Rogers at the end. Oh, nice. All right. I know there's some, uh, I've seen some cool Reggie Jackson cards in tribute. We'll try, man. Stuck at work, game seven. All 
All right, cool, man. Now we can go there. All right, so let's hit up the unparalleled, then we'll get into prism. Angels are going to sign Rendon Garrett Cole and trade for Mookie. They'll still go 88 and 74. And Mike Trout will have, like, you know, MVP season. Let's go. Okay, got a little Keston. That's going to be a good card. Lindor. Kikuchi. And then there's the special, the unparalleled parallel with the stars on it for Milwaukee. Keston rookie card. That's nice. Rotisserie chicken. Is that what's is that what's on your culinary experience tonight, Glenn? Boom. All right. Thirty four likes, thirty viewers. Right on. Yeah, people come and go, come and go. All right, so Prism Mega Box gets you at least gets you one auto, two bonus packs featuring the Mega Box exclusive Pink Prism Parallels. All right, so this bad boy ends. We'll save, I guess, the exclusives. Those are down there, right? Yes, okay. All right, here we go. They do not sell cards. <laughs> they used to, maybe, right? Supermarket cards of years gone by. Felix Nolan Ryan. It's probably gonna be some kind of short print, I would think. Oh, that definitely is. That's for Houston. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Mets, Mike Piazza, Prism at a $3.99. It's funny, it's a different company, right, than Tops, but it almost has like that mojo design, you know, it seems pretty similar. And that's sweet. That was a good first pack. Ramirez, Bowers, Brayer. Yeah, this was a fun release when this came out. Because these also, um, like the hobby boxes, you can get hot boxes. You get like five autos in them. I think we hit at least one or two of them. Or you can get like a serial number hot box. Panini usually in their products has those two things, like in Optic. Donner's Optic, they had the same thing. So like every pack had a numbered card in it. Chris Shaw, nice lumber stand. I want to say this is numbered. No, not numbered. Nice insert. Mother's cookies. Like minor blue. Tell you. Come on, big auto. Modesty. 
Another Aaron Judge. Malik Smith for Seattle. I thought that might have been numbered. What's up, Henry? Trick or treat? Yeah, I was thinking about tomorrow. What uh, what kind of like Halloween stuff would you guys like to see? I, mean, I have a black cat. Other than that, some kind of Halloween spooky wheel. Where it's like trick or treat. Either gonna get like a something cool or like a pack of ADA Donruss. That'd be kind of fun. Cedric Mullins, my man. Otani Scorching. Turner. Benetani. Dress up, Moose. <laughs> uh, possibly snowing. I know it's snowing like all over. Nobody hates you. Marte. De Los Santos and I have bad blood. Feeling like the auto could be in here. Dress Moose up like Chewbacca. Ninety-one flare hits or vintage? Oh, would that be crazy? Here we go. Jacob Jones, Pittsburgh. I love how they make it almost look like it's on card, but it's not on card. Numbered? No, it's kind of refractive to it. Pittsburgh, Jacoby Jones for Pittsburgh. Going to Forks. Live stream. Kevin Newman rookie. That's pretty cool. Yeah, they try to make it. They did a pretty good job of blending that in. It's it's a it's a sticker, but I mean, the white kind of blends through. Pirate hitter is rare. Says <laughs> teeth. Ah. Toussaint. Dickerson, Pittsburgh, required. <coughs> All right, so time for some pink parallels. Let's get some names here, guys. Let's get some names here. Wendell, Tampa Bay. These things are really nice looking, though. Isaac Galley, Miami. Rookie, rookie. And a Kevin Kramer, Pittsburgh rookie. That's not a bad one. A uh, little bit, a little bit, but kind of acclimating a little bit. Getting better. Olsen, Burrow, DeGrom, and a Dames. All right. That's our pinks. All right, guys, we've had the side salad and soup. Now it's time to feast our eyes on a little tribute.
time for that fire. Man, I hope. Six one eight with the Braves one time. Looking for the guy on the cover of the box. <laughs> ah. Ah. So yeah, Alex, these are this is this one of the more premium products. Each pack is gonna have a hit in it. We're gonna see autographs, patches, all kinds of stuff. I should turn off the uh no, actually, that's pretty good. I'll hit the focus like it is. All right, so George Brett, Kansas City. This paper we're trying to block. There we go. And these cards are on crazy, like hard stock. For those of you that haven't held them, when you get them, and like there's really not much bend in them, they're really nice. So Kansas City gets George Brett. And we have a hit coming up. The hits come fast and furious. We got Matthew G with the clean relic. Mets. Rosario out of 99. And what's cool about these is there's a number on that sticker for those of you that don't know. And you can look this number up and it tells you what game this was worn in. So it's an actual game worn jersey. You got a little bit of a blue stripe there, which I like that way better than just like a plain swatch. And you look up that number, Matt, and it'll show you where, what game it was they pulled it from. So those are premium, premium relics for sure. And that was our first of six hits from this product. But it's still good to get uh, there's no, other, you know, base numbered cards that are valuable. You can hit one on one, things like that too. Mookie Betts Boston, that's a car. And we continue. Uh, no, I saw some Orioles in the other stuff. I called out my man Cedric Mullins, rookie. There is an absolute filthy card coming next. But first, we got Paul Goldschmidt. Cardinals. There is a sick retired Hall of Famer coming next. Mike G. Boom. Check that nastiness out. Hall of Fame 80, Al K line, Mike G out of 50. Not sure. I don't think I've seen you yet in chat, man, but. Got an inscription on there and everything. That's nice. Tribute to enshrinement. Love the Hall of Fame on there. Any kind of little extra love you get. Hall of Fame auto. Could be the box hit. We'll have to see. That's awesome. There he is. Good. Out of 50, man. Great card. What's up, Mike? Uh, yeah, let me check. I think there's a late, the late night break. Boom. That's so money. Freeman on bottom. Uh-oh, we may have to talk. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, Mike, there's uh, there's eight hits, and it's uh, the Chronicles and Elite Extra 2016. Let me see. Oh, yeah, there's 12, there's 12 teams left. Yep, there's 12 teams. So let me know if you want, and I'll take it out for you. All right, so we still got four hits left, guys. Yes, that, yes, that was good, but you can, you can hit multiple sillies from this. So let's all stay tuned. And in fact, the next card is a silly. The next card is a silly. It's going to be a good box. Max Scherzer. Nationals. This next card is coming to you via a trade. Via a trade. 
Andy with the Cubs. What is it? An auto? Is it a patch? Oh, it's a sick patch, Andy. Chris Bryant, the triple patch. Got a, got a nice little Cubs there. Nice. All in ten dollar bills. So let's see if Glenn can get something now to make that trade square. Pick the right team for you, Andy. <laughs> so, so yeah, this is probably one of my most favorite products to break so far this year. And we definitely had a box of what did not been like that great, but so far I'm happy with this one. The Bryant and that sweet K line. There's still two more autos. Oh, Carter's Kids. Carter's Kids with the sweet. Go down. Carter's Kids with a nice uh, base card. If he's in here, he probably... Uh, we're not sure if he has that one. Uh, Nationals? Where are you at? Nationals, Nationals... Alex B. Nice card, Alex. And Alex B. Stay tuned because I think you got another Hall of Fame autograph. How about that, boys? Another Hall of Fame autograph. We're talking Tim Rock Reigns. Hall of Famer. Going to Alex B. Boom. Sweet. Two, I haven't seen two Hall of Fame autos in the same box, so maybe we got Hank Aaron 618 coming up last. Dodgers, Lasorda, mouth wide open. Dig it. Dig it. Two more packs. Poor <laughs> All right. Come on. Let's see some more silly. Let's see another auto. Oh, my God. This is the best box of tribute I think I've seen. This is the best box of tribute we've done Hands down. If I'm seeing what I think I'm seeing, good gracious. Wow, guys. There's another Hall of Famer coming up. It might be an auto. I hope it is. Good God. All right, Warren Spawn. This box is definitely clean. Warren Spawn. If it's a tiger, I'll slap you in the face. We go on Robert C. Big Hurts. The Orange Silly. The Orange Silly Big Hurt. Robert C. Stand up and come get this. It's number one. It's one out of 25. It's an eBay one of one. This is nasty. The 35 on there. Broke the speakers. Got to. Henry's like, yeah, he pulls fire. I know this. <laughs> uh, sorry about the excitement. The last the last hit's gonna be a relic, so I probably won't get too pumped unless it's like, you know, Babe Ruth or something. That is sick. I know Robert was in here earlier. I'm not sure if he still is, but uh, he'll be happy when he realizes that bad boy. And we got a Garrett Cole. Could be World Series champion right here. Nice card for Houston. You got it, Mike. Let me take those out for you right now. Oh, perfect timing, man. There's two left. 
There you go. Done. Done and done. All right, um, we, we might break it sooner than that, actually. I'm not sure. i got to check and see uh, uh, anything else in the hopper, any personals or anything. I forgot that this breaks on a lot of cars, so it kind of goes a little bit quick. But uh, there's a lot of fun, though. we got one more hit coming up. You know i got to take a little peek to see what's a Hall of Famer. Oh, another another great card. Another great card. Wow. And my comment about it getting equal didn't come true. But somebody's going to double up. Center Garden for the Mets? Look at that face. Andy F. Going back to you. In a clean Giants. Posey McCutcheon, 50 out of 50. Yeah, replaying baseball is kind of like, but I, mean, I get it. Nice. Good. I yelled my name. You heard the name from the other room? Nice, man. Congrats. Yeah, that was 1 out of 25. <laughs> Did you get to see it or no? Let me show it. Yeah, Big Hurt out of 21 out of 25, too. That's the best. That's a nice relic, though, Andy. Whoo. 50-50 equals 1 of 1. Yep. 1 out of 50, 1 of 1. And the last one's a good card, too. How about this? Kansas City, excuse me. Sorry, Kansas City. Out of 10. 7 out of 10, Murrayfield. That's a good card. KC picks up a nice, the lowest numbered card in this break. Out of 10. That's going to Mike G. Clean. That was awesome, guys. Thanks. I'm glad people got to see that, breaking that. It's a lot of fun. Booklet? No, Henry, Henry's saying that like I'm, I'll be due up for a booklet. Like that. See that one booklet the guy had? What was it? Five star? Like 35 autographs? Ugh. That Indian's booklet. All right. All right, cool. All right, so while we just we kind of hang out and watch the game a little bit, let me get the list rolling. <clears throat> let me get the list rolling for the late night break. What's up, Jesse? Uh, it's not late night, but I just kind of want to get it ready. Let's get all the names down. Triple A Mud Hens booklet. <laughs> uh. Is anybody in the Toledo the Toledo area? Trash pandas. <laughs> All 
All right, so hang out while I get the uh, next thing rolling up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Alex. Yeah, it's sold out, man. You're in Ohio, not super close. You got to move quick. <laughs> yeah, actually, I was, uh, I slacked today in sending out the, uh, the links and everything. It's definitely a slacker. Trying to get the uh, the PSA thing up and running, so I'll definitely have that on the site tomorrow. All right, let me. Uh, I want to keep chat open if I can. And yeah, I think we go. I think I do it like this. Try to multitask these windows. Luckily, I got 16 gigs of RAM now. Can do all kind of multitasking. So what do you guys think of the game so far? Nat's got what, one hit? It's a good series either way. Yeah, I agree, man. You're, you're right. It's kind of like when you get when you get down to like a game seven, you kind of want to see like the like the like the bottom of the ninth win, you know. The game with the pick it was a good one. Ah. <laughs> uh. Candy corn up too. Candy corn burst Walgreens. That is a ridiculous W though. I, mean, I, I just never understand. Yeah, the Nats, you know, the Nats weren't, Nats weren't. According to MLB Network yesterday when I was listening, they basically were like, yeah, the Nats are dead. They're on the, no chance they'll win game six. It's over. It's over. Could be over game seven, but still, you got Scherzer pitching. It's not like if your pitchers show up in these situations where you just win one game. I said to me if I do the next Bills game. Uh, whoops, there we go. Okay. Grabbing the list. There we go. Still in the chat, though. Yeah, I figured the other night, right? That's what I mentioned. I said Cole can definitely... He'll come in on the third day, of course. You guys can stare at that gorgeous brick of PSA for a second. Clean brick of PSA. I know, right? Last game of the season.
Black Mist. Nah, Moose is in the other room. I uh, I actually shut him out of the first half of the stream here. Is that bad of me? Because he's like all in wants table time. See, good, good, good. <laughs> he might be rebelling, yeah. You want to break it up like a tribute? It's like, I don't want to move to that table. Moose <laughs> is getting shot out like the gnats. <laughs> uh. Nice, some catnip stems. Got them the stickiest of the icky, I bet. So also, um, a sneak peek, I'll be going back to Mondays, streaming every other Monday, starting this Monday, and it's going to kind of be like a, I'll have like a Monday, like budget Monday or special Monday, I'm not sure what to call it, but any breaks we do on the Mondays will all be like budget breaks, and I'll have specials on like the set break packs. <clears throat> Monday Madness, I kind of like that. B-I-T-G Monday Madness, every other every other Monday. <clears throat> and Mike K took the last two. Beautiful. All right, let me get that officially put the other break away. And I got the list. Let me go grab a quick drink and then uh, let me check and see if there's any personals. I do got some other, uh, some different packs and things like that coming in. What up, cows? All right, so give me one second, guys. Let me put that break away, and then we'll go ahead and get into it, right? Why not?
All right, guys, give me like two minutes and we'll start to randomize that. Oh, what are you doing?
All right, sorry guys. Thirty-two thousand boxes. Is that how many? That's that how many that Joe's broke? Man, Joe. Top of the seventh. All right, so again, we're three times. Let me get a new sheet. New sheet it up. All right, three times, one, two, three, for the late night break, or the early late night break. Teams coming up three times. One, two, and three. There we go. Now, when it comes to the, the bonus box here, so there's 11 cards. Each card is a hit. There is... Two autographs, two memorabilia, and the rest of the cards are numbered. So we're going to randomize the teams and get 11, 11 more winners when we're done with Chronicles. And we'll write down who... And we're, going to, we're going to open the box and start from the top. Card one was the first and so forth through 11 cards. So that should be fun. Give me a second to put that in the screen. Give me a hot second. Boom and boom. I'll put up the new contestants in one second. All right, there's the new names. And put the teams in. So 2016 Elite can have Soto, Eloy, Big Pete. All right, let me hop back in chat real quick. There we go. Back in the game.
Anthony Rendon with the bomb. Rendon's a legend. But is Rendon in your eBay shop? That's the only way I qualify somebody as a legend. If they are in your eBay shop. Alright guys, so again, when this is done, we're going to get our 11 names. We're going to randomize the teams. We'll keep doing it three times. You can win more than once. Teams can win more than once. Keep doing it three times. Take the, take the top team. And they're going to get the card in order as I open it from the top there for Elite. Nice, here we go. Got Judge right there in the box. Mike Trout coming up first. Move this here so I can see it. There we go. What's up, man? We just cracked the first pack. We just cracked the first pack. Looks like you got Giants and the Reds. Maybe we get you a little Senzel. Back to back Nemo. One of them is numbered. Okay. For the Mets. Burns, big old thick spectra. Upside down Blake Snell for Tampa Bay Crusade. That's a cool card. And a little two tinies. Raph, what's up, man? I got your envelope right here. When I've done this break, I'm um, actually haven't opened up yet. Got a Tatis rookie on bottom. There's a Cincinnati. There's Senzel on top. Cool. Votto. Big Pete. Pete rookie. And we got a hit. Tuki Toussaint. Pretty. Auto patch rookie jersey for the Braves. This one was a 35 out of 99. Tukey could have a nice year next year. It's a cool card. For Sean D. Nice. I got one of these massive top loaders right here for this. Pretty card. First of three autos we're going to get from. This box, we'll see more autos over there. Hicks, there's a Cavan, Biggio, Harper, and there's that Tatis I was talking about. Wrath the Bum. Ricky, what's up, man? You missed the, uh, the mini you were in earlier, but... Um, about like I think the halfway mark you can rewind back and check your name on the screen for sure What it doing Oh nice you watched already. okay, <laughs> you know how to do it We had a really good box of uh, tribute. Multiple Hall of Fame autos. It was sick. Three Hall. Every every autograph was a Hall of Famer, man. Every holograph was a Hall of Famer and tribute. It's 
crazy. There's another Tatis. Kakuchi. Alex Bregman, about to be maybe World Series champion jersey. Nice, Houston. It's going to be a little hot card right now. Nice. Houston is... Glenn. Nice hit, Glenn. Bregman jersey card. Yeah, tomorrow, Mike, for sure. Yep, put the finishing touches on it. I did uh, show off some of the cards. If anybody, if anybody wants to see like a little preview, I can show off uh, stacks in the back there. It's not a secret though. The cards will be um, the whole checklist will be in the uh, on the purchase page. Check this bad boy out, Titan Acuna. That's sweet. Whoa, three two Nats, two two, three two, King Kendrick. Oh, oh, goodness. Goodness gracious. Will Harris. Kendrick stock definitely did not just go up. No one's gonna care. You gotta be. You already gotta be in the. You already gotta be in the collecting system. How many Steve Pierce rookie cards were sold, Joe, after the Red Sox won the World Series? It's another Alonzo. Yeah, if you want me to, Alex. Bellinger on back. Super thick card. Key boom. Otani. Sean Reed Foley. 99. Another rookie jersey auto. Toronto. Oh, this is a nice card, too. It's Kyle Tucker. Kyle Tucker season ticket rookie. This is low numbered, I think. Yep, 75. It's a good one. Still got one more auto, I believe, and a relic. Yeah, that, uh, Mike, that kind of pack, like, you cannot, like, open it. <laughs> it's, like, counterproductive to open it. Pete Alonzo rookie card. Oh, it's just numbered to 10. That's all. No big deal. 
Justin Alonzo, rookie card number to 10. No biggie. Rookies and stars. Alonzo, rookie number to 10. For Forks. There you go. You're like redemption for Mets, right? There's a couple other of Alonzo rookie cards in there too, but not like this. Good God. To 10. Sweet. Sean D has the other nine. That's a pretty cool Copic rookie. Spectra 75 for Chicago. Harper. Stewart. Brand Low. Two holes. All right. Bumgarner, another Alonzo, Canning, Ty Buttree. It's going to be our last signature for the Angels, followed by a Mike Trout for the Angels. It's actually a pretty cool Kyle Tucker rookie. Kikuchi and a Key Boom, Key Boom numbered. 99. I love how he hit Kendrick. That's crazy, guys. Pressure is on. Still top of the seventh. Still, it's still one out. All right. Just by titling it 2011. Yeah, probably. Man, like, I'm not sure. Chronicles is pretty streaky on, like, what teams and players from what I've seen. They got Aaron Judge in the box, you'd think. I need okay, I know what I need to do. I'm gonna use the I'm gonna use the names as how we last left them to make it a little bit easier. It's the same thing. Okay. There we go. All right, so now I'm going to re-randomize
All right, so we got 11 people are going to get lucky and get a card in this. There we go. Paper, let's just use this. Alright, so whoever's on top three more times gets card one. Two. Three. Alright, Glenn. One is Glenn. Three more times. One, two, three. Glenn again. Glenn gets number two. Card number three. One, two, three. Glenn. <laughs> Glenn gets the top three cards. Card four. One, two, three. Mike K. Card five, one, two, three, Charles H. One, two, three, Sam C. Card seven, one, two, three, Brant. Card eight, one, two, three, Charles H again. Card nine, one, two, three, Truth. Truth in nine, card ten, one, two, Three, Michael L. Todd in the chat. And the last one, one, two, three, Robert C. All right, so let me put these in the room real quick. And then we're going to open the box. Now, every card basically is a hit, so... If your name was called, you're going to get either an auto, a patch, or a numbered card. Could be an Alonzo, could be a Soto, could be an Eloy. A lot of prospects in this 2016. All right, let me get back in the chat here. Back in the chat.
there. Okay. So again, card number one is right here. And we're just gonna work it, we're gonna work it down, fellas. Thank God for the auctions. <laughs> yeah, these are definitely fancy scratch off tickets. Alright. So card one, USA baseball. It's going to Glenn. We got an autograph. Season ticket. KJ Harrison. So this is 2016. I'm not sure if he's still a prospect or what. Card two and three for Glenn. We should see some names we recognize. All right, so card two for Glenn, Phil Maton, says San Diego on it. Robert Tyler says Colorado. Again, these are numbered $9.99 each, and that completes cards one, two, and three. So again, this is 2016. We're looking for big prospect cards of some ballers today next card up Mike K gets himself a 2100 autograph Zach Johnson nice low numbered Zach Johnson says Toronto he was drafted in the third round in 2016. Card five is Charles H. We got a sweet little triple patch, 149, Mitchell Cranston, Minnesota. Charles H. Night Lord. And the last card here is six for Sam C. True Harrington also at a nine ninety nine for. Atlanta. But are you still playing? Who knows? That's Sam C. All right, next packs. So we're leading it off with Brant. Grant and then Charles H again in the flat base. Card on top is for Brant. It is Flores, nine ninety nine. Bernardo Flores.
That's low number 99. That's nice. Miguel and Hale Sierra out of 99. That's for Charles H. Nice kind of die cut. Truth up in the nine spot gets a auto. Mark Mathias. Might have been drafted by Cleveland. And here's a name I know that's in the show. Kahil Lee. Nice triple patch. I like that light blue there. It's a color you don't see a lot. $2.99. This is for Michael L. So this is kind of like a Bowman product. With a bunch of prospects in it. Like I said, Juan Soto's on the checklist. Eloy, Lonzo. That's for Michael L. Unfortunately, we didn't hit any of them. And the last card is David Martinelli, Philadelphia. $9.99. That's for Robert C. All right, cool. Three to two, two outs, bottom of the seventh. What's up, Parker? Wow, today's the day of uh, people finding out about little ones coming. Uh, yeah, there were some reds in the uh, in the Chronicles. Nick Senzel, their star rookie. I saw one, at least one or two rookie cards of him in there. Yeah, all the baby announcements today. It's crazy. Off and off. There we go. Going to the eighth, huh? About Scherzer. How about like Scherzer? Not Scherzer. How about like uh, Strasburg comes in to close the game out? Wouldn't be crazy. Yeah, see, Parker, isn't that crazy? Second one tonight, right? B-I-T-G first. All right, let me check the... Uh, see if any order snuck in.
Gotcha. Fall Creek. Let's really track that down. Two hundred and fifty buses. <laughs> ah, that's awesome. Man, Nationals almost doubling up the hits. Ten left on base. That's not gonna get the job done. Two hundred fifty Jimmy Johns. Yeah, I like that one. Jersey Mike's number 11 country club all day. Yeah, positive is definitely a good thing. Yikes. Yeah, what he uses the phone when the phone's dead. <laughs> um, you know, Fall Creek, for some reason, I can't find 89 Fleer. I don't think I'm out. I know I have somewhere, but it's not, it's not here. Pretty puzzling. I might pause it on the site until I locate it. Did you want to hold on to those? You want to do 89 Donners instead? Or maybe you're going for the Billy Ripken instead of the Griffey? Well, why is that on there? Huh. Yeah. Pause that for a second. There we go. All right, cool. Let's do some Donruss. Nice. All right, Forks. All right. All right, so now we're pretty much on the, like, the personal section. I, uh, I have some... More stuff to add for personals tomorrow, and also the PSA break will be a, a fun thing to look at. So pretty much for tonight, I'll be uh, checking the system. If someone puts something through, be happy to to rip. If not, we got these four packs of 89 dollars coming up for Fall Creek, and then I have a uh, I have a piece of mail from Wrath that I wanted to open. And then it might be time to catch the ninth inning. I don't know. J. 
Jimmy Key. Pocket. Brett, so a nice pack so far. Dawson. Schmidt. Coleman should be, in my opinion. That was a really nice pack. I'm opening that thing in the early to mid 90s. I'm pretty happy. Like five, four legit Hall of Famers. Kirby. Monkey Crew. Oh! Nice. Man, it's all centered, but still. That's still cool. Anytime you pull a pack fresh, Griffey. Can't about the centering. That's nice. Typical OC, I know. That's why this thing's like 500 bucks in a PSA 10. It's nuts. But let's enjoy the moment. Pack fresh. Not much fraying around the corners. Corners look nice. No major league record. That's cool. Consider it's out of the, out of the Fleer, and then it's like, bam, the second pack. Take that all day, all day. Yeah, never gonna get old of pulling a grit as a Brett and her sizer. That ever gets old. Trammel. That's her checklist. That's also that's also an excellent pack. So two for two and awesome packs. Rendon gonna go deep again. I, I mean, if they put on like three more run, like even like one more run, and now at least like a home run, you're tied, right? So, oh, for four for four is really good. I've seen a lot of boxes without. Maybe this is gonna be his dud pack joiner. Ah, oh, Biggio rookie, and a Dalton R.I.P. Leave up the busier rookie looks pretty good actually. Oh sweet, two Rendon rookies. Dig it. Man, man on second base. All right, let's see, pull another one. Yeah, cool. Pocket MVP. Carter. Dave Parker. And Gibson. That's one of Dave Parker's last cards. So my gold went done for 25 and one a pack. I don't blame you. Nice. All right, cool, Fall Creek. Thanks, man. That was fun. We've definitely pulled more Fleer Griffies than Donner's Griffies because they don't seem to come as often. All right, good deal. All right. Yeah, man, no doubt. <sighs> yeah, I'm going to sketch around the nuts because I wouldn't. I'm trying to be good about just activating stuff on the site when I know it's like within reach. So I guess let me just cross. All right, so from Wrath, from Carson, I just now realized this. It's not a 1979 Ozzy Smith, it's not a mantle, not a bum. I bet you don't have some of these biggies, Wrath. So Wrath hooked up the little care package. I greatly appreciate it. And I think you told me one card that was in here. Let me just see if I can rip without ripping.
There we go. All right. I got a bunch of stuff in here, man. Wow. Show you everything else. Oh, one more card. One more card. There we go. Nothing else? Nothing else? That would be cool. All right. Care package from Wrath. Bet you don't have some of these. MTV wraps Biggie Smalls cards. <laughs> Larry Harlow, 78. Good old Larry. Just doing just doing 89 downers, Ripken. Love it. 88-89 run. Got the brothers in there. Ah, cool. Frank Robinson. Yeah, this one I don't have. This probably looks numbered too, man. Oh, this card you're telling me about. $299. 1869. This year's. That's a nice card. That's going in a loader right now. Big Frank with the Reds. I see some Jumbo 84s back there. Oh, Soda with the RBI single. Oh, it's game over now. It's, I think it's game over now. Oh, man. Wow. Wrath riding coming. Paul. Huh. Strange last name. <laughs> oh man some of my favorite cards here the three of them on this from 88 Donners too like redeems the 88 Donners set for me Diamond Kings Ripken dig it and the 88 All Star I like that card I like the backs of these uh, no Sotos in that stack. It's pretty much uh, vintage. It does go. There is like a, a 91 Chipper Jones tops and like a 94 classic minor league Derek Jeter card. That's like the earliest card. Love these 84 Jumbo Donners, man. I don't have a lot of these. That's cool. Where'd you find these at? Ripken. Third year Ripken. Calvin. You're sweet, man. Thank you for that. Very, very thoughtful. And you're right. Not a bum. <laughs> not an Ozzy Smith rookie. <laughs> That's cool. Ah, from the Wizard. Nice. 84 biggies from the Wizard. <laughs> Soda for MVP. All right, Canadian. Yikes. Now the home run doesn't tie the game. Bigger yikes. Wow. Let me check the. Uh, let me check. I gotta check the live odds real quick. Checking the live odds. Other oh, locked. Man. Probably because runners are first and second now. That's true. All it's te it's technically the Expos franchise, the Expos Move franchises, right? They just changed their name too. But Astros are six to one right now to win. Six to one, live live bet. 
Six to one. Wow. I wonder how true Expos fans feel about that. Like, do they claim allegiance at all to the team? So do they score again or what's the uh what's the score now? Pretty pretentious. <laughs> That's what I would think, man. That's what I would think, you know? It's like pitching change, I got you. Still 4-2. Okay. Nice. 125 next time, maybe. <laughs> All right, guys, you know what? I'm going to get out of here, too. I want to get to work writing up the PSA thing for everyone tomorrow so we can start booking that. And I will be live tomorrow with more mixture breaks. I'll have a little more personal stuff, too, uh, to, to offer. So until then, enjoy the last two innings of Game 7. I'm sure we'll all talk about it tomorrow. And until then... Good night, guys.